Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm Una. I do project painting and other related content. So if you're into that, stick around. Today we're doing a project 10 uses update plus my Stardew Valley project finale. So the Stardew Valley project pan was a usage-based project um, started by Lady Pans a lot on Instagram. Um, I don't think anyone else was doing updates on YouTube, but I did them pretty much every uh, significant junction <laughs> in the project. Um, it was themed around the community center in the game Stardew Valley, um, so that was most of it. And then there were a couple of challenges at the end, so I am here to update on my challenge items. So yeah, I was working on the challenge items, and um, so I'm here to finally finish out those last couple of challenge items and then update on uh, what I introduced last update, which was a little bit less than a month ago, um, which was a project 10 uses to fill the kind of slot in my... I don't know, I keep doing this. The slot in my panning life for a usage project. I feel like that is important to me. Um, my collection's not that big, but I do want to rotate some things in for uses, so I decided to go with a project 10 uses, semi-roulette style project. And um, yeah, so I put that in this video because there were only two items. So. The challenge items were the challenge items were the volcano dungeon challenge, which was um, you had to finish the um, community center and the skull caverns challenge, <laughs> and of course the mines challenge, which we should anyway all of these challenges. <laughs> um, and for that, I rolled in my um, milk makeup lip and cheek in the shade work. I think a lot of people have this. It was a birthday gift. And um, the goal was to use it 30 times. I used this 33 times. This is what it's looking like. So you can tell, I think, um, the top is a little bit flattened, but honestly not a lot of progress. I did really enjoy this. I really, really like this blush. Um, I especially like it like put on, I, I apply it with a brush sometimes, probably about half the time, but I really do like it better when I just like put it straight on my face. Um, so that's fun. You can now like roll it all the way down into the packaging, which is nice. And um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna try and work on this a lot next year, but I don't know that I'll finish it. This is, there's so much in here. Um, it's wild. So yeah, but that um, is done. It has its 33 uses. The other, um, the missing bundle, which you can finish after the community center was um, this lipstick. This is Revlon Mink. Um, this is what it's looking like. It was basically new when I rolled it in and now you can see it's a little bit used. Um, I used this, I used this 31 times. I thought it was more, maybe I stopped tallying. Um, I feel like it was more like 35, but anyway, this got 30 uses and um, I loved, I loved both of these. I didn't really wear them together all that much, but yeah, they're great. So that is the end of my Stardew Valley project. Um, it was really fun. I'm gonna try and do another video game themed project next year. Uh, so stay tuned for that if you're into those, but yeah, I love Stardew Valley. I should play it some more actually. Um, I haven't played it in a while, but it was really fun and I'm glad I did it. So yeah, thank you so much Lady Pants a lot for doing that and it was a joy. All right, for last month for Project 10 uses, I rolled in four items, um, two eyeshadows, a blush, three eyeshadows and a blush. <laughs> there we go. Um, I roll them all randomly, so that's kind of what happens in my collection. It's about half eyeshadows, so that makes sense. Um, the first eyeshadow was the shade Lunar Spectrum. I'll go ahead and throw up a picture of what it looked like last month, and um, here it is now after 10 uses. So yeah, I hit my 10th use on this today. This is a very peachy um, reflecting shimmer, although it's definitely got the multi-chrome kind of iridescence. I'll Hopefully you can see in the picture the shifts a little bit more. It just looks white in person, but yeah. This is an iridescent um, multi-chrome type of topper from Terra Moons. It was fun to have in. I'm glad I got 10 more uses on it, but that is rolling out. Next is the shade Love Letter from my ABH Modern Renaissance. This is what it looked like last month. And here it is now. Um, I already had pan on it, but yeah, I think the pan's a little bit expanded. It has six more uses on it, which is not bad. Um, yeah, but this will be staying in. Next is my ColourPop blush, um, Super Shock Cheek in Yes She Did. This is what it was looking like last time, and here it is now. It has five uses on it, so this will be staying in. Um, you can see it does have a dip in it, but not a ton. And finally, the shade Peony from my Odense Alba palette. This is what it looked like last month, and here it is now. It is the shade, um, I think you can tell, has some significant disturbance in it. Um, that has 10 uses on it, so this will be rolling out too. So that is two eyeshadows rolling out. 
one eyeshadow and one blush staying in. I think I want to up my total number of products to six for this month. So that means that I will be bringing in four new products that I'm going to try and get 10 uses on. Is that right? Yeah. And I think I'm going to pick two and then I'm going to randomize two. So I'm going to grab the two that I'm picking. Is that hard? No, I'm going to randomize two numbers. Am I going to exclude my eyeshadows? I'm going to exclude my eyeshadows this time just just cause I'm painting plenty of eyeshadows. And um, yeah, so that brings me down to, actually I'm gonna include my like single um, compact eyeshadows. So that brings me to 105 items. So I'm gonna randomize between two and 106. Here we are. So that's number 91 and number 51. All right, so I have those and I have my two picks. So number 91 is this, right? Yes, the So Juicy Lip Gloss in the shade QT. Um, this will be great. Um, hopefully I'll be able to get more than 10 uses on it, but maybe not. I am working on a lip gloss and a project right now, although that's not high stakes. Um, so this will be a delight to have in. The color is shifting a little bit, but I'm not really that worried. I'm going to try to use up the other So Juicy gloss I have next year but maybe I could do both, although they do have a lot of product in them. But anyway, 10 uses on this guy. Um, 51 is my Milani eye primer. This is not ideal because I'm trying to finish an eye primer this year, but 10 uses is not that many. I might not even get all of the 10 uses um, before the next update, and I haven't worn this in so long. I don't really remember how it performs, so it's nice to have it around. Hopefully I'll use it at least a couple times before the next update. Um, the two products I have chosen to roll in are one, my NYX Bear With Me primer. This is like way more of a jelly than I expected it to be, so it's not my favorite, but um, 10 uses will be good to keep me using it. I think I've only used it eight times. <laughs> According to my spreadsheet, I've used it eight times since I bought it, which was a couple, like a month ago. No, <laughs> like three months ago. Time passes so quickly when you have things going on. Um, but yeah, this will be great to get some use on it. It's definitely like not my favorite, but I do want to like use the whole thing up. And I do like the packaging actually quite a lot, even though it's pretty big. And the other product, which I also bought around the same time, is my Lawless lipstick in the shade Suede. Um, it's like a cool toned kind of pink nude, brown pink nude. Um, I bought this because I was looking for a very specific shade that I felt like I was missing. I'm actually wearing it right now, <laughs> which is part of why I pulled it in. And um, yeah, I just want to get more use on it. I think I've only used it like four or five times since I bought it because I've been working on lots and lots of other lip things. But um, yeah, I want to get lots of use on it while it's fresh and good and I'm enjoying it. And I think it adds to the lips, the, the like array of lip things that I'm working on right now. So those are my products. I have an eyeshadow, a blush, an eye primer, a face primer, and to lip products, which feels like a pretty good spread. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Um, stick around for next update to see how I do on these. I will be taking comparison photos just for fun, but I don't expect a lot to change. I think it's just interesting to see what you can do in 10 uses. And um, I'm glad to use these because I don't think, I think maybe this I have not used at all this year. So that'll be nice. And everything else has been a little bit neglected. So yeah, thanks again. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.